Well, hello friends. Welcome back to Rising World. I just might be addicted. I might be. So, let me show you what I've done. I finished the walls upstairs. Oops, I got another piece sticking through. I'm going to have to fix that. All right, up we go. So, I have all my walls in. Doesn't it look nice? Much better, much better. Let's go and see the rooms. We have walls all the way around. They aren't perfect, but they will do. So yeah, we have walls all the way around. We now have all the doors back in. We have this one back in. And those two styles are sticking down in my ceiling, which I probably will fix. And so the next thing is to put glass in all of these windows. And I counted I'm going to need 25 pieces of glass, I believe, and one glass door to go in there and we will see if that works let's go see what we got down here now before in in uh, in the old version of the game we had uh we had glass and it was um you had to have sand you had to get sand to make the glass which makes sense uh, I went with clear glass before, so we will go ahead and do that. Now it just takes, oh my goodness, no, it takes iron sheets. Well, we might not be making glass because although I have lots and lots of iron, I do not have a smelter. And I don't really have a place I can put one right now, but I guess I could make a place. Okay, new plan. Let's go here. I have 114 stone. Uh, I believe I have stone in this one. Yeah, okay. Because I think I'm gonna make the big smelter. So there's coal. I have 95 iron ingots. That's probably, ooh, you know, that's probably enough. Let's make Let's make our, our iron sheets first before I waste time making this smelter. Back to plan A, I think. Uh, iron sheets. Let's, uh, let's just max that out. Do I want 95? Ooh. Yeah, why not? Okay, now I have 95, so uh, I'm going to go back to building and clear glass, and I'm going to make, what did I say, 25? Twenty-five, and we're just going to use panes. Whew, okay, now uh, furnishings, glass doors. The question is, what kind of glass door do we want? Framed unframed. That looks like a storm door. That looks like a store door. Uh, I'm not really sure what the difference is. I guess they have different shaped uh, handles. Hmm. 
Let's go with this one. Eight iron sheets. Okay. All right. Let's go up here. Oh, I'm holding my, my arrow. Uh, something interesting happened. Um, a lion came and visited me here, uh, trying to get through my fence. And uh, I shot him. And then I went over to see if it was my lion, the one that hangs out over here in the corner on the shore. And he was still there. And it was a male. So, yeah, um, I don't know, I don't know. We have spontaneously spawning animals, it's quite weird. Okay, so I wanna put the glass door, oh, that's that looks nice. I wanna put it here, I think. And the question is, I don't know which way it's going to open, and I it it needs to be sized, and then the, and then I want to put glass in, but only on half. So I don't know if this is actually going to work. Okay, that appears to be the right size. Let's go. I think maybe what I need to do first. Let's put the glass in over here. The interesting thing about the glass is that it sizes to the window, which is cool. But if you want to put it in only half, then can you size it yourself? Oh, notice I got this lion head. I, I saw that and I created one and they're huge. I mean huge, but you can't size it unless you're in creative. So I switched over to creative and I sized it, made it smaller and I put one over here too. Isn't that cool? That's super cool. I like it. All right, let's just go ahead and put these in first. This is so satisfying. I have asked on the forum if at some point maybe we can get uh, operable windows, so sliders. Oops. My stairs were working and then suddenly they, they I started getting stuck in there and I have no idea why. Let's see, we have to put some up here. All right, cool. So I have one pane left, and I need to see if I can put it in only half. If not, I guess I could take this this thing down and make a single frame but it was just uh, convenient to have it done this way um, I think I might be able to do this
Okay, and then the see the width needs to be a little bit wider. All right, all right. So So if I just put it in there using the manual positioning, let's see, we'll go down like so, and is that the center? Okay, that looks that looks good. Aha! Uh -huh, I did it! I did it! Yay! Okay, now the door. I want it to go the other way, but first let's uh, make it wider. convincing this is going to be, but we'll see. Okay, so that is about right. And is the top, is it right height? It appears to be. Okay. But I think I want it to swing the other way. So I'll hit end and we'll put that in and see if it swings the right way. It does not. Okay. Uh, okay, so try this again. Put that there, and then we will spin it around. Whoops. And then we will hit end flip it. Is that where I want that to be? Looks pretty good. Yes. Yes. Interesting. Makes a nice noise. <laughs> that is cool. So what do you think? The next Next task, I think, will be to start making furniture. We're going to make, make custom bed frames and put in beds and little nightstands and things like that. So that'll be the next thing that we do. But I need to actually go make dinner, so I will come back later and we will start doing that. So stay tuned. Let me know what you think about the, uh, the upstairs. Oh, okay, I gotta fix that. That's gonna bug me. All right, let me know what you think of this, uh, this glass door and, and my upstairs hotel. I think it's pretty cool. Oh yeah, and we're gonna build a fireplace. So fireplace or, or bed frames. One or the other, we will do that next. Okay, later. 
Okay, I'm back. Now, let's see. I have determined that I think I want to work on the fireplaces. Um, I am going to do the bed, the bed stands too, but I just kind of want to experiment with the fireplaces. And I really don't know what they're going to look like exactly. I might have to move my lion head because I'm envisioning this fireplace to be in the middle. Uh, and sticking into the room, I think. So let's... Um, First of all, I need to change my my name my game back to survival because I was experimenting and uh, I want to play in survival. So okay, um, let's go here and move the lion head. Hopefully, we get him back. Yeah, we do. Okay. Let's uh, just put that up here. And I've got an idea, and I'm not exactly sure how to do it, but let's give it a shot. Oops, back, back up. So I had an idea that I want to put in <clears throat> sort of a rounded raised hearth um, let's see whoops let's go with like 5.5 5, yeah and then Turn that around and make it big. Probably should change my settings. Let's change it to point one. That'll be a little faster. So that width, approximately, yeah, rounded, this isn't that great looking, but it'll work, I guess. Uh, Does that look? Did I actually change my game? No, I didn't. GM zero. Oh. GM zero. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now we're not in creative. Okay, so now I just need to figure out what this is going to look like. And I really don't know yet. So, um, can go there, but it needs to be bigger. Well, 
now it's getting dark, so I think I'm gonna make it daytime. Knock on. I really don't know what I'm doing yet. Is that sitting? I can't really tell what it's doing. on that's probably not helping this might just be trial and error because I don't know I don't know what we're doing now that should be I want to time I want to kind of make like a hmm like a cone shape um so just another um, let's try that, and we'll go what I'm doing here. Even if I turn on my light. I'm not sure about this if that's better or not. Mm. It appears to be mostly whoops in the center. Okay. It's not terrible. Undo the well, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> um, there, there we go. Okay, right. We'll just go up and that's probably going to be too much. It won't really matter though because we're going to have a hearth here too. So we'll bring it down a little. Anyway, Well, no, that's not what I had in mind either. <laughs> uh, let's undo. Is that an undo? I guess not. I don't know how to do it. If there's an undo, let me know. Let me know what the undo is. Because I would sure like to have that. Uh, I thought there was one, but I guess I don't know what it is. Okay, try this again. And bring it down shorter. Work? 
let's just say that's cool. Okay, all right. Well, that's kind of sort of what I was looking for. Kind of. Uh, let's see. Um, oh, I have an idea. I want to kind of rounded edges right here. So I could do, I could make this smaller and then make a bunch of them. So I can make some more of those and put them around here. That doesn't look great, but it doesn't look terrible. All right, let's go make some more of those. We're probably gonna need about 10 of them. All right, maybe I'll do it here. And then rotation should be, oh, let's try five. No, five's not enough. Nope. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Let's see. smaller pieces.
make this work somehow. It's just too much. more. Okay, that doesn't look good, I guess, but <laughs> what is it? It's an experiment. Uh, oh, it's not even touching right there. Jeez. How can I fix that? Hmm. Uh, I'll just turn the light on. <laughs> Maybe it'll be okay. All right, so we need some more. We need uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's make six. Flipped it around somehow. <laughs> okay, wrong button.
かつって。Sort of okay. Now the question is, what do we want inside? Do we want to leave it like that inside, or do we want to put the clay inside? Hmm. I think we need to go make us a fireplace and see what it looks like. When I say a fireplace, I mean a fire. Uh, not the campfire. Um, this. Twelve pieces of log. That they make that um that, that little widget thing that we had before that, that made the procedural smoke because I thought they have some smoke coming out of the top. Uh, way too big. Can we make it smaller? Okay. Well, that looks a little odd. <laughs> doing that. And, hmm. Well, huh. She smokes a bit. What was I saying about wanting procedural smoke? Maybe not quite like that. Kind of what I was going for, but we just may have to have embers in the flames. But I'm thinking it would look better with the uh, with the other color inside, at least on the back end. So let's go make a couple of other pieces. Let's see what we come up with. Oops. Okay, well, I got interrupted there for a second, but I got it finished. Um, it looks okay. It doesn't look super great, but it looks okay. It looks really funny when you light it up. I'll show you. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't understand what's happening with the light. I guess it doesn't see this as solid. Um, and then the smoke comes out. <laughs> so that isn't good, but I think it looks okay. I mean, we just we just won't light it up. We'll just have embers. That'll be fine. Yeah. Well, that was fun. Now we're going to build one upstairs. And I'm not sure if it's going to be the same kind or not, because I think not. Because we have a different sort of a deal here with this post being in the way. So we might have it go... I might need to think about this and do something different. Um, maybe a little wood stove or something? That would work, wouldn't it? With a pipe that goes out the out the um, the wall and then up. Um, the other one, 
the one below needs to vent to somewhere also. Or we can just pretend. <laughs> it is a game. We can just pretend it goes somewhere. <laughs> um, I'm going to give that some more thought. But in the meantime, I can make a bed. Let's use this wood here. And you're going to make a small one. And we have collision on, that's good. If we put on the grid, I think that's floor level. So that would be a post there. And let's make the post shorter. And I think I want to make it square. in here because I'm I want to get the size the right the right way okay um Just want to make sure it's not going through the through the floor. It doesn't look like it is. So we'll put that one there. That one there. It just fits the bed. Okay, now we can move this. And we'll put right about there is good and I want to make this longer uh, and skinnier like 
like that. See, this is what I was telling you about using the grid with these odd sizes, it gets a little weird. Okay, that looks pretty good. So then, Okay, so that's going to go about there, I think. And I want to bring that towards the center of the post. slats. Whoops. Okay, so shorter. I don't know if you noticed, but um, the grain is running the right way now on all of these boards. Sometimes I forget, but they do have a, um, it's under the local texture setting, uh, texture, so force local. That's if you want your grain to run lengthwise with your boards. When you turn your boards, sometimes the grain would run crosswise, which wouldn't be correct. Um, but now you can fix that, and sometimes I forget, but, but that's the way it's supposed to look, right there. So local alignment will do that for you. Uh, all right, that's how I want that. So right about there. We can do actually once we get this in place we can do that and then go across oh I'm all out well before we do that let's go make some more of these and we'll put one in Okay, 
let's go make some more real quick. As soon as we finish this bed, we'll quit for now. Uh, wood. 13. Uh, we don't want any color on there. Let's do... So we'll go here, move it over. Oh, well, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, let's take those out real quick. Um, and we'll do that again. So I'm going to hold down left click and do this and then I'm going to hit the plus key to space them out. Oh, and I only want run row, not two. I think that's what we want. That looks pretty good. Yeah. Okay. So one bed down. I don't know that they'll all be the same, but that's base. That's a basic way of building a bed. Um, so let's put our mattress back in there. down control so I can get this to be placed the way I want. <laughs> All right. straight to me but I guess it'll do okay so there's the bed and we'll make some uh, well, I don't know we'll make some sort of a desk or something right here with a chair or maybe just a chair and a little, I don't know, something, something else, shelves perhaps, a dresser and a, and a chair, that would work probably. Yeah, that looks cool. Another day down. So we'll be doing some, um, oh, that doesn't look quite perfect, does it? Oh well. Uh, we'll be doing some, some more decorating and, and making stuff in here. Uh, I, I went and downloaded a bunch of art posters and things to, to put up. And um, so we'll do that. And and then I'm also going to be working on um, getting our, our, our kitchen done as well. And then outside here, we're going to do, um, we're going to go ahead and make our smelter and our baking oven and maybe clear out the grass in here and, and make sort of an outside work area. Uh, 
so yeah, a bunch of bunch of different things to do. Um, but it's coming along. So that'll do it for today. See you next time. Bye-bye.